Good evening, welcome back to another episode of Keeping Up With The TikTokers. On tonight's episode we are joined by TikTok star Jamie Callahan to discuss the struggles of starting TikTok and being on TikTok. From things such as zonal sounds to fairy comments and all the other things, he's going to talk to us about the struggles of being on TikTok and the things that often get in the way of being successful on TikTok. Now Jamie Callahan currently has 2k followers on TikTok, very good entertaining videos if I do say so myself, and is also known for his infamous tooth gap. So stay tuned as we speak with Jamie Callahan. Alright, so we're here now with Jamie Callahan and he's going to talk us through the TikTok process and how TikTok actually works. Thanks for having me. I'm, um, yeah, I'm actually really proud to be on here today and just, you know, sort of represent the whole TikTok community and, you know, show everybody what TikTok is actually really like and, you know, maybe they might sign up then and make an account things out. So, so yeah, I'm really proud to be on here. So thank you once again for having me. What's the problem? So the first question I actually want to ask you is so what was it like when you first started TikTok? So like, what was the whole aesthetic of TikTok and what was the whole like TikTok thing like when you first started TikTok? Okay, well I, well I started TikTok in about October of 2018 when TikTok first started becoming a thing. The only reason why I downloaded TikTok is because like, there was like several YouTube advertisements about it. Like all you ever heard, saw on YouTube for advertising was TikTok. So I thought, you know what, let's just download it see what happens. So I downloaded it as like a joke kind of and then obviously a few years later it became quite addicting so yeah. So back then TikTok was just a bit like musically so there was loads of lip sync videos, loads of like dancing videos, not as much as there is now but they're actually quite good videos and there was like lots of creativity and you know everybody liked each other, there was no hate, there was no sort of you know it was just quite a fun place back then, but obviously it's a bit different now, but yeah, that's what it was like back in the golden days of TikTok. Oh wow, that, that seems like a lot of fun. So what do you now think of TikTok as like a whole now? So obviously you started like two years ago now, but obviously things have changed now, so what do you think of TikTok now? <laughs> it's okay to cry. Um. Um. Well. I feel like TikTok's just kind of ruined. <laughs> so what do you think probably ruins TikTok then? Like when did TikTok like just go wrong? So I feel like, well, I just feel like like mainstream celebrities and dancers, things that have just kind of ruined TikTok as a whole. And plus obviously, I feel like over the recent months, like there was just drama on YouTube, like just moving off TikTok, and it's just completely sort of ruined the entire aesthetic. Like, you can't really have, have as much fun as you used to back then, but obviously, that's just, with it, that's just how times have changed, you know. So, yeah, I feel like it's still kind of fun, I still like the app, but. I just. Yeah, it's just a bit of a mess. So I heard you had a bit of a drama with TikTok about wearing denim in videos. So explain to me what, what drama you had with wearing jeans in a video and how you got shadow banned from TikTok. Oh crikey, yeah. Uh, um, so basically what happened was on the evening of June the 15th I think I posted a video where basically I did like a slideshow of my Instagram to try and promote my Instagram. <laughs> On my mom and Instagram posts, I posted a photo of me in jeans and they were quite skinny and then that's when TikTok banned my video, like they literally shadow banned my video so it's not on the FYP anymore because I'm not sure uh, what happened but I just felt like TikTok was just dis discriminating against me <laughs> so yeah but that was my whole entire skinny jeans scandal if you call it that but yeah that was quite tragic. So moving on to the bit of a positive side, like what are the most positive things about TikTok? So what makes it like, a brilliant platform that is right now? Like what things have happened to you positively since you've downloaded TikTok? Oh boy. Okay, so um well the one positive TikTok is I am able to download Subway Surface, not sponsored, because I saw I see a bunch of TikToks like where they play Subway Servers, like to certain songs, so that's like kind of content nowadays, and so yeah, that's one positive. And plus I feel, I feel like on TikTok you can still be creative and you know have a bit of fun, but you just gotta be careful what you do now because obviously this YouTube drama has kind of moved on to TikTok, like, like I said. It's it's quite fun, but you can be quite creative and you can also get clout. So yeah, that's my whole positive take on TikTok. 
So last question now, do you think you'll ever quit TikTok? I'm gonna go with no. Like, I actually kinda like TikTok. I just love the mess that is TikTok. And so, yeah, even though I said all those negative things about TikTok, I still wouldn't leave the app because it is quite addicting. And so, yeah, I just love the mess that is TikTok. All right, well, thanks for being here today, Jamie. It's been a pleasure having you here interviewing me today to discuss what TikTok is really like. And I feel like I've learned that quite a lot today on TikTok, so, yeah. Make sure to stay tuned next week as we interview Dixon and Emilio and ask what the actual song lyrics are to a new single at Topping Charts that were Be Happy. As some of you may know, her lyrics are quite weird and we need to just, you know, try and analyse some of the song lyrics and, you know, just try and get the truth from what her lyrics actually are. So make sure you stay tuned next week. And thank you once again, Jamie, for being here. And uh, so, yeah. Well, that was a weird one. I know this video is kind of weird and not very funny. I know it's probably the most terrible video I've ever uploaded, but I don't know. I decided to do this video today because I don't know what else to post, really. So I thought I'd just make that video. And um, so, yeah. It's probably the worst video I've uploaded, though. And so, yeah. I know everyone, everyone's going to unsubscribe for me for this video. I'm probably one, one like in this video because this is probably the most terrible video I've ever uploaded. Like, I actually tried to make a funny skit video and it failed terribly. It's not even funny because there's nothing funny in it. I hope you like this video. Don't forget to leave a like, share, subscribe, share, notification in this video. Let me know what videos you want to do next and I'll follow you guys. But as always, guys, I've been Jay's Waldy. We'll see you guys next video. Good and bye.